So, here we have the iPhone 7. Hey, what is up guys? I'm KBHD here, like and Apple is now it. making a new iPhone color. The same That's right, it's real. It's not screen, fake. It's on their website design, and everything. And it's happening. Apple is now making with the a red iPhone. And, uh, and lucky for you, we already have one there. here in-house, so this is your exclusive is first look and unboxing of the red iPhone. So this is the box for the new product red iPhone. Anymore, and Apple said other product Apple red stuff in the, the past, more mostly iPods. So instead, uh, and I'll touch on those in a second, but this is the first the product red iPhone in the box ever made. The and while new colors of phones halfway through and, uh, the year normally seem like a cheap grab for more media attention, so you can this one in, uh, does not have me mad at all. Uh, this is also a 256 gig 7 plus also for the record. So right on top of the box, you'll get the paperwork like normal, actually a red product red card on top with everything else you normally get. Uh, product now, red, for those who don't know, changes, is Apple's uh, couple of special edition red products, and purchasing them gives a portion so to support HIV and AIDS programs and research for them. So you can learn more about that at red.org. Like it's a laptop. good cause. Uh, so yeah, you uh, get that, uses, uh, and as you saw, uh, some normal white Apple like stickers, no red stickers or anything crazy like that. that. And then of so course, it, after it the paperwork is to, the red iPhone, while, and first impressions are, exactly the same wow, as, this thing uh, is really red exactly and really good looking, just as pretty so one in the, the flesh as in all the really bright ads, which is saying something, those look great. I mean, this is really red, plus the front is this white front, like the special edition color iPod touches they did a couple years ago. It's interesting. So setting the phone aside for a second, you also and, uh, see everything else on the box is exactly the same. So you have the lightning ear pods, your charging cable, your wall connector, um, they're all white, the, etc. The same things, iPhone 7 experience. Lighting effects but yeah, like wow, this matte red anodized aluminum to is actually so as ridiculously back, good as you'd think. I hope the camera can do it justice, but I really like the contrast of the red with the black of the camera cutout and the logo on the back, the product red branding, it's all super clean. And that makes three new iPhone colors after has come out with in this um, past year. More the product red, of course, is brand new. And uh, but we also did get also that, that new matte black, black so you'll iPhone see better late last on year. Screen, and, and we also saw the glossy jet black iPhone well. alongside that as well. New, so we have some uh, new stuff LED to choose from. Has four and LEDs the red in there, color, I think, has pretty quickly brighter. moved up to the top um, of my so favorites, as much as I like the matte black. It's when honestly the most photogenic phone I've seen in a long time. Seriously, the matte finish, it's so saturated and really bright. Because of the anodization, it has this sort of a satin look. And I don't think it's going to that many fingerprints because You'll it's not pure uh, black. Man, so I think Apple should do more colors of the iPhone, like this imagine a green or a blue, and stuff like that. Now, I gotta say, the only thing holding plus, this red plus. iPhone back for and me, and actually a lot of people, if you were on Twitter nice, this morning, you'd see, is the front of this phone. Why did they have to make it white? I mean, nothing against the white bezels. You know, some people like that. That's fine. But this phone could be a full-on MKBHD edition red and black masterpiece with a black front. Imagine now, I don't know, the, something the about the white is, front is marginal, looks a bit goofy to me, like it doesn't match. There is more, uh, also, the new Touch ID home button they have on these when, iPhones, when they could have totally the, made this silver uh, ring around it take, also uh, red or camera, black, it's sharper, but they didn't. Seems like an obvious there is, oversight. There is Not a deal breaker, details, but so kind of weird that they didn't do upgrade. that either. Either way, this had people brainstorming so ways to the, make uh, the perfect red and black so iPhone. Turns out there's three life. possible uh, ways to go full red and black. Number one is allegedly the, the front of these iPhones is really easy to take easily. off and we replace from like another iPhone. So if you had another black iPhone and a red one, you could take off the black front and replace this white front to have a full red and black iPhone. But that means you have to have two iPhones. Number two is you can just put a black skin on the front of this phone. So it's red on the back. The, black on the, the front, iPhone 7 but that of course means you have to have the, the red go. phone already. And I also so don't do really like the, like the front skins well, on the phone. It feels kind of weird. So number three, which is probably the most common, easy way to do this, is to just get a red skin for the back of your cameras, current phone. Obviously, it won't be the exact same anodized metal look or anything like that, but this is by far the simplest way to do it. So I'll drop a link below the like button if you want to.